so today today we are going to be discussing <clears throat> on this ride home what a SAR means to me from based upon the knowledge I've learned and my connection with a SAR. A sir, well sir, well sir, well sir. That's why they got Osiris. Well sir. It's no vows in Kimmy. So <clears throat> it's full road. Well sir. Right? Well sir. Full using ridge. Well sir. Right? I know. <clears throat> Osar is the god of resurrection. In the middle of nature, he is the second of Gab and Noon's child. The first being Ruh the Elder. Second child of Noon and Gab. You know the story he was born. Maybe you don't know the story. Here's the story of, of Osar. Right? His wife, one of the different stories, because there's many different, the middle nature is a vast country, so all of Africa, so there are different applications, different personifications, different scenarios. But according to one scenario, it was Heru her, 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 the Elder, then Osar, and then Set, and then Osset, or ass and then nefties or nevhead they were all sisters they were all family so Sar was married to a set and nefties or nevhead was married to set <clears throat> so one of the stories is basically that Set was jealous of him because Asar was the king. He was he was the the god of civilization. He was what, what we believe civil, civilized people. He was what taught us agriculture. Asar is agriculture. Right? And one of the Marinetries is the god of agriculture. <clears throat> Different perceptions, he's the god of many things. Asar was served as the god of many, many, many things, right? The resurrection, the lord of the underworld, the call of Osiris, lord of the underworld, lord of the dead, right? They built statues in his name. The, the monument, the Washington Monument is a, is a tall penis, right? Because of, out of respect of Asar, seeds, planting seeds, right? <laughs> right? We humans, the, the dick is what drops the seed, it spreads the seeds. That is a Asar, a ragged culture, <clears throat> right? So, thank you for that. <clears throat> so, one of the stories, there's a lot of stories, man. The very nature is deep. So one of the stories, Seth finds him, Seth kills him, he dismembers him, and then he spreads his body throughout the land. A set goes throughout the whole land, finding a body. She finds, she does have to do different things. In one story, she had to go be the, the, the servant of a queen and she put their baby in the oven because she's the goddess of magic. Another story is um, she found them. But yeah, that's one of the stories that she had to, <clears throat> had to go work with a queen in a foreign land who didn't know who she was. She was she, she's the goddess of magic. She can, can change her image. <clears throat> right? And I got doing about all set. Well, what I said means to me is about what I, what I gravitate from all set. Um, but yes. So, Sar, she goes and gets his body. But she cannot get his phallus. <clears throat> so, Ampu, the god, her nephew, the god of, let's say, judgment, the god of 
the, the opener of the ways, the mentor, the, the elder, right? That's who I'm pulling with. So guide, something to help guide you. You need an elder to guide you. You need a wiser adult to guide you. There's a difference between knowledge and information and wisdom. I think we need to remember that. Information, knowledge, and wisdom are not the same. <clears throat> we need wisdom. We need to apply wisdom, understanding what to do with information, understanding when, where, how to use information. Okay, I'm getting out chat. Let me go back to Asar. Let me get back to Asar. Good afternoon. Hey. How are you doing? All right. So, Asar. Yuvi, yeah, Azar is regeneration, resurrection. <clears throat> so, so she brings his his phallus back. They make love. From there, she they birth Haru. <clears throat> they birth Haru. And he is who defeated Set. So, Set is in the middle of nature. Your animal side, your e your quote unquote selfish side, your ego, the side of you that you know that you that you constantly do fuck shit, but also the side of you that when shit get the ugliest, nigga he there. You feel me? The real nigga side of you, which is not a bad person. Set is not a bad guy. Said it's not evil. What my nigga Michael B. Jordan said, the antagonist. Okay, you gotta understand what the meta nature is. You gotta understand there is no bad guys. There's no good guys. The Sphinx, Marke Haru, is a is Haru's head over a lion's body. A peaceful lion, but it's still definitely a lion. Let's not pretend. Let's not play. Let's not act like, oh my gosh. Nigga, there's a lion here. You really lions do lion things. They're lazy sometimes. But they're strong. They're selfish. They don't fuck with people. They are not the good guys. You go to nature, lions aren't the great guys. Lions are lions are just a part of nature. Right? There is no good guys. Said is a jackal. They didn't do that by accident. Jackal survived. Jackals flourish in the desert. The desert represents <clears throat> your vastness, the biggest part of you. The, de the biggest part of America, of the world is inhabitable. There's only a small part of the world that's civilization. You go through the world, it's a jungle, it's empty, it's just plain land, it's vastness. It's the biggest part, it's beautiful in its element, in its naturalness. But you try to live there, you, you can't have, some places can't have civilization. Some places civilization haven't been there. Some places, you know what I'm trying to say? So, Asar was Sir Osiris. He resurrected. They call him the God of Resurrection, Asar Kimenenti. Why is he resurrection? What does represent resurrection have to do with agriculture? What does resurrection have to do with gardening? What does resurrection have to do with DNA? <clears throat> Saw represents DNA. Just some. He represents many things. One of the definitions of a saw, one of the, the synchronicities, because it represents multiple things. That's, right? It's a symbol. So, what is symbol? What is one symbol? The God of DNA. Why? Because he's civilization, he's God, he's, the, he's something passed down. Rebirth, re resurrection, rebirth is also DNA. You are all of your ancestors, you are all of your ancestors seed. Right? There are multiple strains of apples, there are multiple strains of oranges. Right? Different DNA, different molecules, different molecular structure. <clears throat> Agriculture is a God. You understand what agriculture is, you understand 
understanding of how this planet works, understanding the time. You gotta, you give me, you gotta understand time to do agriculture. You have to have an understanding of the soil of this planet. You have to have an understanding of how nature works. You have to have an understanding uh, discipline. You have to have discipline to live.